Please don't. Weather Wave won't succeed if they don't do this. Do the, if they do this again. Okay, let's watch this. Let's see what this person is saying. Since we didn't get to play it. I'll just say if I agree with him or not. For the future of Within Waves. Another chill video, we're just gonna be yapping for like 5-6 minutes about something very very important that Kuro Games needs to do. If you're new here, no, I'm not gonna dump on the game, you probably don't know that I love this game now, but there are some crucial problems that we need to talk about. So many people were talking yesterday about uh, how the game is gonna be launched in 2 months. I don't know if this is a leak or something like that. This is a very good time, yes, but but to be honest, some things should be addressed first. The main problem is with Kuro games, not with the game itself. This is the main point that I want to talk about today. Okay, I don't know much about Kuro games. Team. If you don't know, the marketing team of Kuro games... Okay, <laughs> you were talking about it earlier, <laughs> about the, the marketing team being bad even, to increase very, the numbers of enemies game, in open world. No one heard of it at launch. And in a video is it empty? About how to prevent the game from dying, one of the main points were that the launch of the the game should be good and should be big. So I think that Kuro Games should be careful with that and they should do their best in sponsoring many streamers, either English speaking or foreigners, because they really didn't do a great job with PGR. And they will probably make a survey. You're, at the end of Maz, this you're making this same, ex same exact so point one of earlier. The things that we need to talk about, all of us, is that the launch of the game needs to be good and they need to advertise the game. Or it's gonna be rough for them. I know, I know, this game is kinda big now. A lot of people are interested in it, but in reality, this is it's not, not empty, enough. but it it's, feels like it less more advertisement. Okay. So, again, I hope that everybody watching now that cares Peter about is game, way too sweaty make a survey or something to market. Whether we will have a lot of marketing initially, with the game alongside with talking, yeah. I mean, they have more things to showcase is, in this for Within Wave than PGR. PGR is just instant based combat. Here, you have open world and combat, even right now, so they can make some people play PGR more since people. People are talking about weathering waves. It's a very good thing, and uh, I mean, shit, they got me. Now, that's not our only thing that we want to talk about. <laughs> uh, he's a fellow really sim. I see. Two months. This is a very good time. <laughs> they need to rush fixing Oops. all the localization problems. For example, San Juan C6 is literally the Yang Yang C6. Some weapons do have wrong substats. It's normal to be in the beta, but will they fix everything in two months? I okay, don't I, didn't get, I didn't get what she said. What? So they can make some people play PGR more since people are talking about weathering waves. It's a very good thing and... Uh, I mean, shit, they got me. Now, that's not our only thing that we want to talk about. If the game is really launching at two months, this is a very good time, but they need to rush fixing all the localization problems. For example, San Juan C6 is literally the Yang Yang C6. Some okay, so the translation problem you substats. mentioned it's before. Normal to be in the okay, Yang what about the substat? I Some didn't get it. Do have wrong substat. Wrong substance. It's to be so it's a bug. Will they fix everything in two or just months? like a full on coding issue. We're talking about every single language here, maybe except for Chinese. And if we check here, why I is walking animation? Every single language here. I don't like his running animation at all. What is this? I mean, it's not running, it's more like a jogging. I doubt that because we're talking I don't about like it. It looks. It'll, it's not just me, right? It, it looks Will bad. Fix everything in two months? I doubt that because we're talking about. I don't like his single. jogging animation. I returned to PGR when Alpha came out. <laughs> yeah. Language here. But do you guys like his uh, jogging animation? What are you guys' opinion on this? Yeah, some already spoke about that problem. Which problem? The their animation. Like I don't like this. Like. I, it could be the reason that I am not uh, into guys, but uh, in, in general, it just doesn't look good. The jog animation sucks. See, okay, I'm not the only one then. Here, maybe except for Chinese. And if we check here, I think it's it's jittery crazy. too. Like, imagine, look, notice. Okay, I'm just gonna full screen for this jogging part. Like how he's jittering from left to right. It's like it's not smooth. He's just it's like Chinese. restarting. And if we check here, I think the beta but will they fix like restart restart months? every left right re it's the restart of the job every single language it's jittery too it doesn't <laughs> it's uh, like here, bad in so many ways a handful amount of language i think maybe it's only a problem in english i don't know 
But even if we're not talking about localizations, I the walking and jumping need more improvement. Absolutely, because the, most people, that people okay, most people that will play Withering Wave is gonna be like casual player, and the casual player will spend more time just moving around their character, just chilling with their friends if they're into co-op or if they solo play they will just be exploring the world they will be doing this stuff more i said it during the tower fantasy time as well they need to improve the jumping animation it's very tiny and, it's, and some people might uh, argument that argue that you know it's not affecting your gameplay so it's it's fine but it's a it's it's a matter of uh immersion this jitters ruins the immersion in my opinion so like they might be small and they might not affect the actual gameplay but they will affect how people how much people enjoy the game but anyway but let's see what he has to say we don't want this game to launch at when natlan comes out so i don't think two months the natlan comes out okay he's mentioning of that too and it's still before natlan some things don't need to he just talked about natlan i'm going to repeat myself here but as i said there's soul frame coming from warframe uh, the from the Warframe dev, it's heavily inspired from Elden Ring combat, and it's the open world co uh, co-op single player game. Elden Ring is coming in June twenty first. Elden Ring DLC is coming June twenty first. So every PC pairs, I'm not playing saying players, pairs slash play players both combined, they will go run straight to Elden Ring DLC. Then uh, Blue Protocol might be around the corner as well. Blue Protocol is going to flop, but it will take some of the players with it. And uh, what else? There was another game I was talking about earlier. I forgot. Uh, or was it the Nathline I mentioned? Either way, there's there are way too many games are coming out in that June, July, August, or May, June, July, August, this phase. If Weathering Way wants to succeed, they need to go uh, like early May or even before May, April. April. These April, end of April or early May should be like a good time for Weathering Wave to come out. To be fixed at launch, in like there is like similar mode, things, similar things more, but the only available characters like that, are the MC and healer. Problem, to be honest, we can just play for three months and then they add any new thing. But for example, I noticed that so many people didn't like the gliding a lot. So many people talked about how the jumping feels a little stiff sometimes. Like you see, yeah. I'm, I'm kind of teleporting, not jumping. You see, the double jump is cool, but when you jump, it's kind of weird. And to be honest, so, I don't yeah, know true. why I we agree. should just wait for the end game. Of April is uh, HSR any bad time for them. Then they screwed up already. Wait? I mean, I'm gonna be real. Like, it's okay for this game. For the me. only other option they have is wait till the wave is over. Like, June, May, June, July, August. Like, end of August. If they really want to wait, it's probably going to put down a lot of people's interest if they do that delay, though. So, I don't know what they're going to do. I'm... I would be in. I would be very worried if I was Kuro Games, because I can't release too early. Because of course there are a lot of problems they need to fix, and I don't really want to release it during all the waves that are about to come for multiple games that every player is looking forward to. Uh, they're probably gonna play a game like Elden Ring that they know that yes, this is a good game, so I'm just gonna go play that DLC instead of trying out a new game and just feel like oh i'm just i just wasted most of my time i mean it's video game playing video games is might be considered you can consider it like a waste of time in any way but fun is subjective how to be launched at this state it's very good people will enjoy it but to be honest it can be more polished so why wouldn't they just take their time so this purpose of is, is he not going to mention the story discussion as always in the comments but also to make people remember that there is a survey for the game and they should actually fill it out and talk about every single problem that they think is in the game so we can improve this game that's why it's in beta that's why we need to voice our concerns yeah so that, true. that, was uh, that is true talk about. so and the people who really are about. into beta please talk about it to steal, you're gonna lose every single 50 50 in your life and i'm gonna i have lost every single 50 50 in my life kafka don't even talk about it <laughs> it's not it's not even funny anymore but anyway he didn't talk about the, the uh, story though the story won't be changed again but uh this i am not talking about like it won't be changing anytime but you guys said it's a problem now he didn't say that as a problem that's what i'm saying 
I hope they left the story as beta one. That uh, yeah, I, I remember you saying that. So what is the? I mean, they can change it, right? They can change it back if since if they get like a major. Uh, I I believe you're not the only person who's saying that the uh, first story was better than this. They could go that route because I don't think they would delete the whole thing altogether. But yeah, it's not a problem, but not to most of the players liking. Okay, I see, I, I see what you mean. But yeah, these uh, are probably going to be like the... Because they're bigger... Uh, the problem he mentioned is probably the, like the biggest concern because their main sell is the gameplay, not the story. Like again, for Genshin HSR, their main sell point is the story, the characters. For them, is the main combat, but it didn't really go well for Tower Fantasy, so I don't really know how well it's gonna go with for them. I just hope that they give us like just enough to help us connect with the characters. I don't ask too much. Just just enough to connect with the characters. That's about it. Borderlands made by Netflix, really? I don't know. Watch that. More problem is the gacha artifacts and how bright it is. Did they made it like too much too bright? Like it was too dark and then they turned it into like too bright. <laughs> I mean, he he was only in the like the wreckage area. So in for in that video. And I'm not watching more than that. I just wanted to know a YouTuber's opinion and I got it. They should leave this substats thing. Well, I hope the people who are in beta, like not the people like... Uh... It's a good thing that I don't... I am super bad with names. Otherwise, I would just name those bald YouTubers, who, bald uh, Hoyo YouTubers, like who just rant about like stuff that they don't. They have no idea what they're talking about. Uh, video games in general. But uh, anyway, I just hope the people who are talking uh, gonna give them feedback are the people who knows how to play video games. That's about it. TF isn't the same category as Weathering Wave, but Genshin Weathering Wave will be more successful than TF due to single player slash Kuro Sims tax after leveling them up. Okay, Maz, I, I am like, my I, I'm unconsciously trying not to understand what you're trying to say because I don't want to go in until, I don't want to learn about it until I get my hands in there. But yeah. Uh, wait, Maz said, it's so bad that you need an item to unlock substat. I agree, Genshin system is better than... Oh, so it's not just like you level and you get substat. You have to spend more currency to unlock the substat. Okay, yeah, that is bad. Like, I am leveling it so I can unlock substat. What's the point of leveling it then? I guess this is the main stat is going to increase from leveling. <laughs> but that's kind of pointless. Anyway, guys, this is a short stream. I haven't slept. But uh, I just wanted to come back in my usual time. Because I haven't streamed it. Yesterday, because yesterday was supposed to be my last stream, so my streams are gonna be like a bit wonky from now on. But I will try to get into like a proper schedule. Yes, but I saw two types of item. Two types of item. It's not just even one. Wow. <laughs> okay. All right. I, I guess we'll see. I guess we'll see whatever they do. I do hope they can fix all the problem and then just come out. The higher rarity might be a specific set. TLDR within wave is worse Genshin, but you can run without stamina and run up walls. Yeah, okay, thanks for the stream. Thank you, Owl. Thank you, Mas, for hanging out with me. Thank you, the lurkers, for lurking. I appreciate it very much. And I will see you guys next time. I'm not sure when it will be, but uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. <laughs> Take care, guys.